Welcome back to Newsbeat. I'm Alexandra Cranford. Well, yesterday we got a good soaking here in Baton Rouge. The good news is most of the heavy rains are finished. Now we've just got these overcast skies hanging out over us here in Baton Rouge. Take a look at temperatures around the area. They're not too bad. Most places getting up into the mid 70s. At Lafayette's at 72 degrees. New Orleans at a high of 75. Up in Shreveport, a tad cooler at 71 degrees. Here in Baton Rouge, we're up to about 74. We had some fog early this morning and we still have some upper air disturbances in the area, which means that we may see some rain as we head into the afternoon and e early evening, and it'll stay up there over the next couple of days. Tonight, that um, chance of rain will stay about the same at about 30 percent. We'll also keep that high humidity, which is now in the 90 percent. Also, watch out for some rain uh, as you're on the roads and for some patchy fog, especially if you're going to be driving around. Tomorrow, that chance of rain will increase. There, there's about a 50-50 chance that you'll see some showers when you head out tomorrow. There's also um, a chance that we'll get up into the mid-70s, but as we kick off the weekend tomorrow afternoon, It'll get much cooler. A cold front is going to move through the area, bringing with it the cooler temperatures. It'll drop into the 50s and we'll also see some south winds really picking up. Let's take a look at the five day forecast. We'll get highs on Saturday and Sunday in the low 60s. So you can see the effects of that cold front. It'll be dropping into the 30s during the night time. So it'll get much prettier once we get there. And if you're headed to S Tiger Stadium, on Saturday night, you can expect some pretty nice weather, very little chance of rain, although it will get pretty chilly. That cold front will be moving through. The temperature will be dropping into the 50s and later on into the 40s as the night progresses. So it may be chilly, but it'll be worth it to watch those Tigers take on the Trojans. And that's all for your weather today. Here's Hobie with more on that upcoming game. Thanks, Alex. Coming up in sports, need your fix for LSU basketball? We'll give you the details about the Tigers' opening weekend. And why the football team shouldn't take the Troy Trojans so lightly as they come into Tiger Stadium Saturday night. Next on Newsbeat. 